Then we're going to walk over to Gromps. We're going to start with the small Gromp. Work our way to the big one. Give that big Gromp a snipe. And we're going to split it in two. Split it in four. And we're going to try to make something happen bottom. Leona, are you ready on my count? Three, two, one. Leona, what the fuck was that? Okay, we're just gonna go back in our jungle, cause fuck a bot lane. We're going to take Scuttle's gold, because he will not be needing that. But once we get blue buff, we have enough mana to roam around the map and gank. Looks like top is definitely gankable. We're going to, oh, seems like he knew we were coming. No worries, we'll just go back and kill another Scuttle crab. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four, now you're dead. Okay. Ooh, he's definitely low now. Looks like we can go in and gank Yasuo. Oh. He used his ultimate to uh, win dash to a minion, it seems. No worries, we'll just tickle this top. Okay, looks like we're just going to go back to lane. And now that we have... All this gold from the jungle, we can go back and buy some items. What we want is some pointy toe boots and gloves with spikes on them. Bottom lane, looking like they could use another gank. So what we're going to do is kill golems. Actually, I'm going to help Lux gank bot. It is warded, so we must make haste. Leona is using the brilliant strategy of giving her useless corpse away while Twitch and I one-shot Brand. Now that they're dead, we're going to kill Blue Drake. It unfortunately is blue, but it's still a Drake. And we're going to say hi to Scuttle. Give him a couple of boops. Bang, bang, bang. And his gold's mine. Okay, we're going to hit that. Boopity bop over the wall. Snipe the red and continue on through our jungle. Once we acquire another Gromp tongue, we're going to look around the map, do a little boopity bop over the wall, try to gank this Yasuo again, walk in and bop him right on the head. That's gonna be a tower. Now that the tower is down, I'm gonna tax the lane. Actually, I'm just gonna walk away and we're gonna go back and buy some more items. Actually, I'm going to help Garen survive this gank. And actually, we're going to go back to base and buy ghost swords. At this point in the game, you can farm each lane as if it's your own. If the other laner gets mad, just explain that you're trying to help them push their tower. Not only their lane's yours, but don't forget about the jungle. What you want to do is let him take Scuttle. That way you can bait him into your team and kill him. After that, the rest of the team should follow up. Just spin and pop him on the head. At this point, we want to kill the second dragon by one-shotting it. And going to middle. Now the reason we're middle is because, don't forget, we have to farm our lane. And patiently wait for the next wave of minions to spawn and continue to farm those as well. After those are farmed, you want to push the tower. Oh, okay, Rumble uses ult. That means he's dead. There is now no one to defend his tower, so what we want to do is go into the jungle. We're gonna boopity bop over the wall and take blue. Now that we have all the mana we need, it increases the probability of us soloing Baron. Come on. It also helps spinning around Baron to try to hit the eyeball, even though you can't. Yeah, it looks like Garen's gonna help us out here. Okay. So this clip actually never happened. My software glitched and it just threw this in the video. So we're gonna ignore that and buy a Bloodthirster. But we don't have enough gold, so we're just going to sell the machete. Actually, undo that. No, sell the machete. No, undo one more time. Uh, definitely sell the machete. Now we... not nah, fuck that. We'll have enough gold to get it. Ah, fuck, we don't. Okay, so just sell the machete and get the bloodthirster. 
Go back to your lane, farm that wave, bam, 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 bam. Wait for the next wave. Bam, 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 bam. Now that your lane is clear, you're gonna boopity bop over the wall. And it seems like mid needs some help, so we're gonna go ahead and get red. And obviously one shot that red, boopity back over the wall again, and perfect timing for that dragon kill. For that dragon kill. Ah, okay, good. And it seems like we got a team fight going on. <clears throat> so we're just gonna go farm our lane again. Farm, farm, farm. And at this point, you're just gonna wanna get the tower. I mean, I mean, you're gonna wanna go out and help out your team. <laughs> if you're new to the game, you might want to skip this clip because it's, a, it's an advanced tactic. So what you want to do is you want to go into a team fight and then die, knowing your Twitch will kill everything. There's something that you have to remember when you're playing this champion. It's not about winning. It's about psychologically breaking them down, leaving them with 1 HP, and following them around the map, giving them hope that shit, he uh, snared me, but fuck. That just about wraps up everything you need to know about this champion. And then you just, uh, yeah. Okay, yep, that's, uh, mm-hmm.